doing, man? I'm fishing, man. Ah. You sent him down? Yes, get him down. Any problem with that? No problem, man. Good work, George. I like it. Listen, I see seven more of those containers out back. Let's rig some more up. <sighs> Boss is gonna be mad, man. Yeah. Now tell me something good. Now I've got some bad news and, uh, and I've even got worse news for you, man. I spit it out already. You're not gonna believe it, we lost the kid. What? I swear to you, and how it happened, I'm telling you, it's like a movie, it's like a science fiction thing. And? No, so we're on the transport, all right? And I've got tall doors watching him. This bloody tank camper, all right, he jumps out of the seat, opens the bloody door of the airplane, and jumps out. That's interesting, but uh, unbelievable. Did you recover the body and the briefcase? Well, apparently he's somewhere deep in the desert. Yeah, the tall bull got sucked out with him as well. What? Who the hell's tall Bill? Tall Bill, you know, the tall big guy, the guy who's working for me. What's tall Bill getting sucked out have to do with not recovering the body and the briefcase? The kid survived this thing, man. Well, apparently he's somewhere deep in the desert. Oh, this uh, Enwa Butcher guy kind of guy. No, these are some bad, bad owens, man. Bad, bad guys. 
Say it already, tell me. No, what we think it was best that we sent uh, Grimsy out there to, to try and negotiate with this guy. That psycho. And? No, they took him out, man. I asked you to tell me something good at the beginning of the conversation. Now it's all going to hell. No, I'll take care of it. I'm going to find it. You got to sit tight. I think I know who to send in. Tommy boy! Hey, hey, hey. How you doing? McGurk? Well, who else? Listen, I'm sorry about Montreal, all right? Yeah, me too. I heard your last gig went south also. Yeah, well, I'm done working the amateur hour. I can't blame you for that. And you're mistaken if you think I'm gonna clean up another one of your impossible messes. I haven't even told you what it is yet. I already know. It's a rush, impossible, homicidal, genocidal, maniacal suicide mission set up by amateurs to save money grubbing foreigners from a bunch of Middle Easterners. I'm not gonna beat around the bush. We've lost a lot of good people out here since the uprising started. 20 minutes ago, Intel got a lock on a top priority scientist. And already this morning, he survived falling out of a moving aeroplane. And now he's in a no-man's land being held by some desert rat named Anwar. Anwar. Great. You know, there's been a great deal of money invested in this project. It can't be allowed to fail. The country needs you, Bruce. You understand? You didn't leave an American in the field. It's an American? An American. A scientist, yeah. Another Middle East job, another Middle East mess. If you want to get paid, then you do what you're good at. You understand? Chopper's waiting to go. We drop you in as close as possible. You'll leave with transport. Secure the kid. Head to the rendezvous point. You're done, in and out, just like that. Never gonna happen. I need to prep. I need proper intel. There's no way in hell I'm getting dropped into anywhere right now. Yes? Ah, my God. They sign guys to be me. Be here, Blanky. No, there's been a hitch, but, um, I know who to send in. Why didn't you send this person in to begin with? You need to use the right tool at the right time. You understand? We are becoming vexed with your handling of this whole situation. We are considering switching to Moti 21. Do you really want to play that card? We have done that several times before, with success. This situation is different. You choose that course and you're risking international humiliation for both our countries, not to mention possible retribution. The repercussions of which will be easier to deal with. I'm telling you the situation is under control. I give my guy four hours. Esty Ramon. Yeah. Good to see you, I guess. Yeah. What the hell are you doing out here? I'm your point man. I'm here to save your ass, buddy. Do not tell me that this is what you're bringing for me to drive around in. Yeah, she's a beauty, isn't she? Look at her. No, 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 no. You take this out. I'm supposed to meet somebody here with a Humvee. This is an RV, top of the line. You name it, it's got it. I mean, this thing is beautiful. American made, Tommy. That's the most beautiful part. American made. It says Fiat. 
I'm supposed to get transpo here, a, a Humvee. I'm supposed to meet somebody and get a Humvee. RV, Humvee, it's got four wheels. It's ready to rock, man, just for you. Does it have any special features? Top of the line. Top of the line, it's got everything you need, American made. Kevlar tires, bulletproof windows, six inch armor plating, satellite tracking, bulletproof dashboard, solar panels, the works, man. Whatever you need. Can this thing withstand RPG hit? Got RPGs hitting this thing, it's knocking it right off. You got LPGs hitting it, knocking it off. PGAs, PG 13, HBO, NCAA, VHS, DVD, Blu ray. Plays Blu ray in there. You want it or not? What about the WPGA? WPGA, NBA, NWA, NAACP. It looks like you're making a National Lampoon Middle East movie. Yeah, well, guess what? You're Chevy Chase. Grab the family, get in there, and get the hell out of here, right? You gotta be joking. You gotta keep it undercover. You know that. Look at me. I'm dressed like a bum. Yeah. Nice sandals, nice touch. Thanks. They're cute, aren't they? I'm walking around the corner of Abdullah and Muhammad Lane buying hummus like it's going out of style. They think I'm just some idiot. Well, they know. Skilled if I wanted to. This is undercover. I'm undercover. It's beautiful. It all sells itself. Nothing personal, but I just don't. No. I mean, I don't take it personal coming from an old timer like yourself, right? Right. You right. still doing this? You got your bifocals on? <laughs> when are you going to hang it up? I mean, we all heard what happened in Montreal, right? What do you mean, you all? Everyone heard about Every, it? I think everyone heard. You still think you're ready for this? Well, I guess it's better than nothing. Well, that's what they say about me. SD Ramon, better than nothing, right? Jump in here, knock yourself out, do what you gotta do. I think you'll do good. All right. Here she is. She's a beaut. Enjoy. Where are you going? I gotta go. I got a thing. I'll take good care of it. You got it. Can I give you a lift? No, thank you. What? I got a thing. I gotta go. All right, be careful out there. Quit crying. Whatever you're selling. We never serve, we take. But you are trespassing. That's a serious crime here. I know trespassing is serious business, but I'm not trespassing. I'm here looking for Anwar. We work for Anwar the Butcher. The Butcher? I hope we're talking about a different Anwar. Do you guys know anything about a kid falling out of an airplane? Yeah, we have him. You'll meet him soon.
laissé ma voiture. À l'instant, l'entendre Spacing in the settings of things around here. Listen, Cam Dinar, how much? I know the Arab is here, the Arab who fell out of the airplane. I want him and his case, how much? Some other American asked me that recently. And? He's there without back. How unfortunate for him. But how much do you want for the kid, Cam Dinar? How much? I want him and the case. I know they're both here. What do you think I would need? I'm king. This is my own kingdom. You are standing in my backyard. Kingdom? I didn't know Kitty Litter Land had a king. All I see around here is you using local tribes as slave labor. You see any oppression? Considering it's about 3,000 kilometers to the nearest United Nations complaint office, and you people have all the guns, what is it exactly that you guys are digging up? What are you mining here? I don't know. 
I just know it makes me a fortune. <laughs> <laughs> All right, money talks and people walk, so when's the next train out of here? This person don't claim my land without paying the bill. Any question? Not currently. Good, <laughs> because the show is about to start. <laughs> you like a, a Russian roulette? Well, who doesn't? Who doesn't? Did you happen to have a briefcase with you? I heard you have a briefcase. Where is it? All right. Okay, what's in the case? It's a top secret. Right. It's okay. I'm here to rescue you. <laughs> oh, thank you. I, I feel better now, my friend. Yeah, you, you, you risk me. Yeah, good. Thank you. <laughs> oh, I'm glad you feel better. Yeah, Superman. <laughs> you thinking about trying to uh, escape, or did you think maybe it would be cool to hang out here a bit? I have a plan. That's good. I'm all ears. What is it? I have um, psychic, uh, psychic powers. This is my little brain. I'm going to see Psychic powers. Powers. Psychic powers? Pekis. Yes. Powers. Okay. Pekis powers. That could work. So, how are you going to use these psychic powers to uh, tell me the plan? I'm going to shoot the man with the big gun. By the door. Can you handle the guy with the how the receiver? How about that? Receiver. Big sword. Big sword, yeah. Sword, sword. And everything is okay. Okay? So you have a gun. I have in a moment. Don't worry. Russian roulette. My pleasure.
Pojď na nás! Pojď na nás! Pojď na They're moving. Oh, we're never gonna catch him in this piece of crap, man. The jeep, we need the jeep. The bloody jeep broke down, man. I say we take him now. Talk to the plan. That worked with very well, huh? Not bad. Maybe there is something to your device after all. Maybe. Are you on your way to the rendezvous point? No, man. We're not on the way to the rendezvous point. Some very, very bad stuff is happening here, man. <laughs> Told you I should have stuck to the plan. Hang on, man. Hang on. Yeah, I'm back. What the hell is going on out there? No, everything's okay. I was just taking care of some business. I just found out that your facilitator busted him out of the butcher facility. You never said anything about that. Hold on a second. Hell, this bloody guy, man. Yes. Cancel the drones. My guy's got the kid. He's secure. Morgan, aboard, aboard, aboard. Bring right. Hello? You still there? You're not being straight with me, man. Listen, if I don't have all the information, people are gonna start dying. They have a device that allows them to shift time. Uh, what do you mean? How do you expect me to do my job when I don't know all the bloody details, man? I said they have a device. The kid invented a device. It was being transported with him in that case. He must be using it. He probably is. Wouldn't you? You told me this was going to be a simple hit and run. Move in, move out, and I'm done. You got to pay me more money, otherwise I'm walking. And you can forget about this bloody mess you're making here. <laughs> Don't worry about that, because you're all going to get extra hazard pay. 
hire some more guys, and get to the rendezvous point. Ashes to ashes. Do what we must. Stupid Irish bastard. Actually, you know what? There's one for you, my friend. Listen, there's a lot of unfriendlies around here. We gotta blend in. Let's put this on. Is this how you guys got out of prison too? Mm-hmm. That's how you're gonna knot and climb down the window. Motion, those were some brave action hero moves you pulled back there. No, it's not brave. It's not about that. I told you, I have second powers here, second powers. You don't believe me, eh? Not really. You see me pull the trigger and the gun at my temple or not? That, that's exactly what I'm saying, man. That's impressive. Brave stuff. Only a madman pull the trigger in his temple like this. Only madman, not me. I know what to do. Psychic? You're not psychic. If you were psychic, you'd just, you could tell me what I'm thinking no, no, right no. now. You, you don't believe me, right? You don't believe me. Okay, Mr. Psychic, what am I thinking right now? Whatever I say, you'll just turn around and, and say something else. You're psychic, but you can't tell me what I'm thinking right now, is that right? Sure. You're thinking about how great the view is. Ha! Huh. That is absolutely not what I'm thinking about. Okay. That's the last thing I'm thinking about. I, this view, I would be happy if I never saw this view again. I would be happy if somebody flushed this view down the toilet where it belongs. You really want to know what's going through my mind right now? I cannot remember the lyrics to Long Tall Sally, and it's starting to piss me off, a little bit like you. You're psychic, but you can't tell me what I'm thinking right now. Is that right? Um, you're thinking about uh, you are angry because you don't remember uh, the words from uh, Long Tall Sally. And you are really nervous now with me. Uh, what? Hey, I, that's, I'm speechless. I don't know what to say. That's... <laughs> you don't look like the savant type. What? Savant? Savant, yeah, they told me you were a little bit off. Like some kind of, you know, rain man. Uh, what, 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 what do you think? I'm not an autism case. <laughs> I'm believable. I'm <laughs> Okay, look, let's just drop the shenanigans. You tell me what's in the case and why you think the organization who sent me to get you in the first place is out trying to jump us. You want to make some money? Yeah? I'm looking for two people, okay? There's a white man and an Arab. I need the Arab, I need the white man dead. You see them running around here any times? No, no, no. Hey? Yeah. I'm paying good money, American dollar, US. How much? I, I give you, I give you $1,000 per day. Five, five. Five, 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 five thousand. No, 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 no. Listen, shut up. Okay, $5,000, you do the job. If you don't do the job, I find somebody else. You want the job? You see this monkey man here? Huh? You see him? I need to find this one. But the Arab boy, there's a real Arab boy. I want him. Take a very good look. Look careful. Look at it. No. This man, I want him dead. The Arab boy you bring to me, and we do $5,000. No, Can you handle? Me. Can you handle this job? No, okay. really yeah? Right, yeah? You're going to do it? Yeah. Okay, we shake. Yeah, yeah. Okay, 5,000. No, no, no. Five. Five. And I need you to do it now, eh? Right away. No time to waste. Go. Go, go. I'm not going anywhere with you. Understand? I tell you not. Uh, look, if you're not here to kill me and uh, keep my case, I want to go. I want to go. Allahu Akbar wa sallam I want to go. Keep the call. Just sit tight. We're going to follow through with the original plan. We're going straight to the rendezvous point and we're going to take you and whatever's in your case and get the hell out of here so I can get back to the real world. So the rest of the planet 
where traditional people live is not real. It's not that it's not real. It's just that nobody cares. You are a racist. The real world is like the house where the real families and the real people live and they, they entertain, they eat, they sleep, they make decisions there, real world decisions. Your world is like their garden. We are just insects in your garden. Now you're getting it, that's exactly right. Our problem for you is nothing. We are real too. Your people living in a bubble, in a bubble your people, hey top. The United States of America, where the working man lives. Real working men, working people. While you people are out wondering what to feed your camels. Look, 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 look around. You see? You see any camel here? What do you think? Here is the Lawrence of Arabia. This is the richest land in the world. We have oil, our population have culture, have everything. We are rich, not like you. Ah, uh, that's what this is all about. Oil rich families out here breeding like flies. What I can talk about is America, and I can speak for all Americans sitting at home in small town America, everywhere, without passports, no interest in traveling abroad. Yeah, they're probably living in a bubble, but you can't blame them for it. They just don't want to be bothered with all the nonsense that's going on over here. Your thousand year war you've been having, Muslims and Jews. Because, I mean, who? That's. That, that, that gets old after a few years. I mean, you know, World War II was what, four or five years? thousand years you guys throwing rocks at each other come on man that's boring and they certainly don't want their tax dollars financing it that's why the government has to dumb them down hey real world 78 percent of the planet it's poor i've heard all that before man but it's not about rich and poor uh, you're a racist there it's not racist bro it's just realist ignorance is bliss you know Ah, my God. It seems that we now have a new problem. The kid has activated the device. I'm already aware of the situation. This has gotten too far out of hand. Everything is still under control. I have men combing the area. The satellites tracking their every breath. And once they run out of power, the device will be useless. They think they're ahead of the game, and if they want to get out of there, they're going to have to come through me. It's not easy being a real worlder, especially being an American. The sheer tonnage of crap that we juggle every day would just boggle your mind. Like what? Trust me, you do not want to know like what. Your, your brain simply couldn't handle it. It would explode. Try me, try me. Stuff you don't understand, like people that are in the real world, they go to work every morning. They, they have to know what time does McDonald's stop serving breakfast? What time is the mall closed? What time does Starbucks close? Why does Starbucks even close? It should be 24 hours. People want to drink coffee in the middle of the night. I don't know. What time is the Cineplex open? These are things that we got to know about and we got to juggle on a daily basis. Which cat food do finicky cats really like? Which detergent's going to get my whites whiter? Is Van Halen going to get back together? What's my sodium intake? How much is gasoline per gallon, not per liter? Because I got to buy a bunch every week. I'm commuting. Kids that cost them a fortune. Private schools. Orthodontists. I'm commuting in my huge SUV. I'm driving some big American gas guzzling pig. And that's just the tip of the iceberg, my friend. Real worlders want to know things like, which mouthwash really allows you to get a little closer? You know what I'm saying? What car has more farfic nougat? Which celebrity or star is going to successfully make the jump from TV to cinema? These are important questions, man. What cigarette really does have the lowest tar? Is Sizzler going to keep cheese toast on their menu? What's the cold filtered beer? Which deodorant really works best under pressure? What candy bar really satisfies? Which grain alcohol is going to make me look the coolest when I'm approaching girls up at the singles bar? Huh? Huh? Who will the bachelorette pick? Will there be a Jersey Shore reunion? What is Honey Boo Boo and, and the Pawn Stars? What are they going to do next season? They're shoving stuff down our throat faster than we can even... It's like waterboarding with advertisement. Madison Avenue. I understand, Tony. Super Bowl advertising. Mike Tyson? The Super Bowl, man. A million dollars a second. Or is it a minute? I don't know. It's ridiculous. Which breath mints have the best tasting flavor crystals? Which eye drops get the red out? And which fucking breakfast cereal has the most goddamn fiber? That's the stuff you people don't need to concern yourself with. But us real worlders are burdened with that on a daily basis, hourly. 
the ugly reality of the real worlder's mind. Relax, 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 relax. Do not tell me to relax. I know which shampoo is best for dry and damaged hair. Hey, hey, Adam, you are old man, your heart, the problem, uh, relax. I'm just trying to explain to you what it is that goes on up here that you, so blissfully ignorant of all of this, you people will never understand any of this. If you like this place so much, why are you trying to get out of here? I wasn't trying to be out of here. The uprising is started and the organization said to me to move. Next thing, they are kidnapping me. Kidnapping? You, you do realize that I'm from the same organization? Did you expect I stay in that hall forever? I knew the organization uh, uh, sent you. Why the hell did you come with me if you think that they are kidnapping you? I go with you because you weren't wearing black. This is, you think it's some Frank Miller comic book? Dick Tracy? Thanks for getting me out of here, okay? Thanks, but please, I don't, I don't want to uh, see you again, okay? I want to leave. Drop me the next town, okay? The, the next town, I go. Just sit tight. We're gonna follow through with the original plan. We're going straight to the rendezvous point, and we're gonna take you and whatever's in your case and get the hell out of here so I can get back to the real world. Understand me? Look. Listen and look, I'm not going anywhere with you, with you, I'm not going. Like hell you're not. Hey shit! We're running out of gas fast, I bet we took a straight bullet to the gas tank. Calm down, I'll pull into this little <laughs> toilet. And get you a bite. I'm really sorry for everything. American! Hey, come. I'm really sorry, okay? Love and peace. Look at her. Down. We gotta go. No, 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 don't worry. It's good for us. Shh, you are a really good friend. Look at that. Top. <laughs> you are really stupid. Tom, I never see guys stupid like you. <laughs> What's the matter? Why are you so sweaty? Uh, Ron, with the coming. Hey, Tom. Hey. Hey, Tom. You want the, you want the hair? Stupid joke? 
Not right now. No, no, no. That's... Ah, wait right here. Okay. It's here, the rendezvous spot? What a view, huh? Just sit tight, wait for the big bird to come. Hey, Tom, you, you see that movie, uh, The Passenger, with uh, Jack Nicholson? Passenger 57? With that guy, what's his name? No, 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 no. Always bet on black. No, no, The Passenger with Jack Nicholson. Kevin Bacon. No. Oh, what? Bacon, Kevin Bacon. You don't like bacon? No, 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 no. You don't like bacon? No. How is this rendezvous going to work exactly? Simple. A big black helicopter is going to come right over that hill in a minute and set down right here. We jump in, it flies away, and all your troubles are over. Black? Don't overthink it, kid. Tom, you want to know what I think? No, I don't want to know what you think. I don't think anyone is coming here. I don't think so. I don't think you were supposed to get this far. And you have lucky because you had me with you. I don't think you're going to win the most positive thinker award, but you're welcome to your... Yeah, yeah, welcome to paradise. Yeah, you're welcome to your own ideas, but just sit tight and uh, you'll see a big helicopter in a minute. I, I, I hate this place. <laughs> ننظر لطقس الجميل قبل ما امشي للواحد اننا نبحث على امريكان صديقنا لا 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 اقدر اساعدكم انا اكل على الامريكان وما اعرف احد ما اعرف ما اعرف ماذا تريد على الامريكان هنا ماذا هل تعرفون شيء هناك قوات مسلحة أمريكية يتحركون هنا وهناك عندنا أخبار من أحد من جماعتكم Press the button again and ask me if it was McGurk himself who sold me out. لا لكن أنت تع تعرف هل ما قلك ها على هاي هايلو؟ نعم خيلو ولكن كيف أعرف تخيلو؟ Hey Tom Tom, it's true. Hey, it's true. قالوا لي عندكم أمريكان وهذا ما أظنه. لا هذه هي هم الأجانب هم الأمريكان طيب تمام لا 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 مش مشكلة مش مشكلة. أفكر مثلك تماما. شكرا عليكم. مع السلامة يا أخي. مع السلامة. مع السلامة. مع السلامة. مع السلامة. الله يحفظك. مع السلامة أخي. مع السلامة. الله يحفظك. I'm American. You got a problem with that. The line forms back there. But this is American infield there. Why is he nice with me? As a beam. Are you a pilot? We need to charter our flight. I flew in here, huh? You flew in here. Where's your plane? 
How far to the airport? Four years ago, that was. Are there any planes? When's the next flight out of here? Flying. <laughs> out of where? <laughs> where is this airport you're talking about? See that little bit of a stump over there? Just onto the left. Yes. And the mountain. Yes. That mountain was flat. That was the airport. How far to the border? What border? Is there any place we can... What sort of border you want about? Any border. We want to cross any the border. Any border. We want to cross border. You want to go over Iraq? You want to go over that border? <coughs> Which border you want, boy? Eh? You've got to be careful. You said it was dangerous. I suggest it is. What about... You want it? You're asking questions. English? Do you want answers? No, no, no. <coughs> oh, la, la. How much you prepare to pay? 200 dinar. More than 200, there's an uprising over there. The military will not let any flight fly out of this zone. Really? No fly zone over here. Military, no fly zone. We gotta stop flying. Hmm, period. No fly. I'm going to meet you Thursday, and by the time it comes back round, they say, oh, you're, you're blah, 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 and he's very thirsty. Them ones. What's then, the word I'm looking for? Quantum physics is, is how you think about things. The power of thought is very, very underestimated. What do you know about quantum physics? I said I know a lot about quantum physics. Meditation for a start, it depends on which way you actually focus your mind on what's real and what isn't, and what capabilities you've got. You think you've only got six capabilities. You've actually got a lot more than that that you've never expanded. I've, I've been following the shamanic path for 20 years as well. You sound like a college professor. I used to be. Oh, oh you were? Till I lost my mind. <laughs> so you're out here looking for your mind someplace yeah. in the desert? No, I'm not looking for no mind. I've, oh, I've never lost it. They, they think I have, but I've not. Who's they? they? The people that it was employing me. Who was employing you? You're asking questions. How far, how deep down the rabbit hole do you want really me to go? Ah. Oh. Well, I've never asked you any questions, have I? You've quite... only just woke me up on a Sunday afternoon and all of a sudden poked me up with a gun and this and that and you're asking me so many questions that it's all unbelievable. And I've not asked you one. Now it will come to light how I did start quantum physics and meditation all in the same particular time because I tried to escape from a prison I was in and I was locked in solitary confinement for three months. It was actually six months, but I'll tell you the three months later. If you hold all the energy and hate inside you, who's it hurting? Only yourself, because it's pressure. So get rid, and get rid, and be free and balanced. That's answering your quantum physics side of the story that you asked me. Can you understand what yeah, I'm trying yeah, to say? Yeah, yeah. I... I'm talking to you. <laughs> hey, what are we, what are we doing here? This guy is crazy. I don't think we're gonna get any transportation out of this guy. You go, go. I, I don't understand nothing. Can you go skiing down there? This way, look. Is this for motorcycles? I think so. 
That's yeah. some serious jump. Uh, it gets into a jungle. I'm really tired. I'm hungry. We gotta get all the way down to the bottom. Go. You want to eat a goat? Field. Which one? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The baby? No, 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 no. Big. You had a kebab right back there at that damn cafe. What's the matter with you people always eating? You see, you say, say Americans are fat. Philippines. Yes, I saw. Do you know who lives there? Yeah. Who? Michael Bolton. I don't think Michael Bolton lives anywhere around here. You gotta watch that kind of thing. <laughs> cool, though. Yeah. Where? Eh? Let me know. No, no, no. Go back. Eh? Let me know. 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 Let What is that, American? I've not seen anything. What is that, Abik? What do you want? What do you want? I'm gonna kill you. I've not seen anything. I'm gonna kill you! Tell me! Tell me! What is that, Abik? What is the matter? I'm not saying it! Nothing! Tell me! Tell me! Tell me! Tell me! Tell me! Tell me! Tell What the hell are you doing? I'm done dragging that around. But that's part of your creation. No. What do you mean, no? It was just a decoy. A decoy? But before you told me that I wasn't uh, sure about you before. And now? Now I trust you. I guess I ought to apologize for what I said about the real world and... Okay, friend? Friend. No, 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 Ar no, Arab. In your heart. I trust you. We go. Hi. Look there.
السلام عليكم اخوي ورحمه الله وين مالكم؟ لا 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 انا هنا في اني ننظر لطقس الجميل قبل ما امشي للواحد اوشن نو مور اب جاب يو سبيك انجلش ناو يو هير؟ لا الله يحفظكم ها السلام عليكم Captain, this is Mike McGurk on Black Halo. McGurk, how can the U.S. Army assist Black Halo this time? There's two bogeys headed your way. One's an American, the other an Arab. They have a briefcase with them. The case and the Arab are top priority. You know, I keep scratching your back. And I'm just wondering when you'll do the same for me. Never stop wondering, Captain, because when you do, your time will already be up, my friend. My men are heading your way. Grab a chair. I'm Captain William Hunter of the U.S. Army. U.S. Army? Since when are you guys in the business of killing civilians? You killed those people the moment you approached them. We couldn't afford to give up our position here. But what are you doing out here? Are we under arrest? I'm an American. I have rights. I've had to relieve you of all your weapons. For your own safety, of course. We can't have any accidents. I appreciate that, but we've got to keep moving on. I told you it's not safe. There's a substantial enemy presence in the area. Right now, we're jamming their comms, stalling for evac confirmation, and then we're gonna light this place up. I can appreciate that, but we've got to keep moving. I told you, it's not safe. Are we under arrest? I'm American, you know. I'm afraid I must insist. For your own safety, you see. Come with me. So, what is an American and an Arab doing out in the middle of Amarakistan? Don't you know there are uprisings, hostile takeovers, coups? You wouldn't have anything to do with that, would you? Black ops, mercenary, that kind of yahoo? No? Let's go. So what is it exactly you think we're doing here? I don't really know. I suppose the same thing the Russians tried. Same thing Taliban's trying right now. Let me put it to you like this. Imagine an America where you wake up every morning with a call to prayer. Have you ever heard that? It's irritating. TV is not TV. It's the Real Housewives of Beirut or Keeping up with the Husseins. 
on America, where Americans have been outpriced from their own country. Sounds like the hellhole America is right now. You're just not getting it. We are the best option the world has. If that case falls into the wrong hands, it's game over for everyone. You know what? This is really turning into an incredible speech. Have you worked on it long? I think you ought to save it for someone that really- Where's the case, Bruce? That's an interesting brand of cigar you got there. <clears throat> Easy! I'm American, man. This is bullshit. Hey, Doug! Doug! Can you hear me? Yeah, yeah, I can hear you. Uh, hey, I don't understand. I, I had a full send, but, 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 but no reception. Calm jammers. They got the surgeons pinned down not far from here. What are they going to do with us? Well, actually, they were asking about the case. They know? Uh, it's safe to assume Halo's got guys on the way over here right now, but don't worry, I got a plan. Which plan? You're gonna have to sit tight right here. But I'll be back. No, 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 hey, hey! Tom! Wait, please! No! Hey, hey, Sand Kaffer and that uh, Bruce character. Where are you holding them? You need to relax. We need to talk about more product. I gave you product a week ago. You're already over it. I'm in the middle of another job. Give me a few days. Let me clear my business. Now I'm out. Do you know how many bodies I have piling up in the back here, waiting to get sent back to the States? Listen, it's not my fault that you guys don't know how to fight your own bloody wars, okay? I'm not here to fight a war, I'm here to do a job. I need to make some more money. 
all right? And shipping product is not making the money that I need. What I need are those two bloody monkeys that I've been chasing around this bloody country, and I need them right now. I got them deep in a hole. That's all you need to know. There are some very, very powerful people looking for these two, okay? And if I don't take care of them, it's going to be my head on the chopping block. So you need to now help me, okay? Stay low. There it is. Just like I said. What should I mind? Wait here. When you see my signal, hit him with everything you have. Unleash hell. Okay, which one of you is signal? Don't worry, you'll know the signal when you see it. Oh. What's happening? Kidney stone. Wait for the signal. No, 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 no. I'm holding on to them as security. When I get my ass out of here, I'm gonna need a little insurance. Okay? You got to help me and you gotta help me now. Otherwise, no more product, never again. Are you threatening me? These people will take me down and take you down before you can even count to one. Relax. I, I got don't you. have time to relax. I told you. Keep your voice down. For what? Uh, what you gonna do otherwise? You know what I'm gonna do with Show this. Show me stuff, guy. You need to relax really? now. Okay.
Bloody hell broke loose over there. The kind of people that came in, they took out the American base camp. Yeah. Yeah, now I've got the kid. Is he right here? Yeah, I got him with me. And the case. No, he doesn't have the case. Listen, don't get pissed off with me. I'm on my way to get the case now. I've got the kid. With the kid, I get the case. Okay. All right, I'll check in with you. I've got to head to the igloo. Get to work. Disappointed you weren't able to complete your mission. Where's the kid? Sentimentality is a handicap for people like us, Bruce. There's no point in working him over. Now, where is the kid's briefcase? I got the case. You know, you really are too moral, Tom. That's what your problem is. I tried to spare you the seedy details of the unforgivable world of international espionage and barefaced diplomacy. Why don't you head to your igloo? Time to pick up your pay. You make a call over there and tell him to hold off on dishing out the rough stuff on the kid. I'm going over there right now. I'm going to do for you. Where is the device? I just talked to Bruce. He has the case. Ease off the kid and be ready. Oh. All right, I'm on my way. Listen, uh, I gotta move out because uh, we got some crazy shit happening over here. Right, boss, right. Bruce, where's the briefcase, man? I buried it at the base of the tree out there by the well. Pretty good. Listen, keep an eye on these two. I'll be right back. You got it. You stay quiet now. Stay quiet. Understand? Come in, boy! 
nasty. Take it easy, G.I. Joe. Easy, G.I. Joe. I'm not one of Uncle Sam's misguided soldiers anymore. I didn't know fairies wore boots. Wear boots! Oh, fairy! <laughs> Come on, soldier! Come on, old man! Take a shot at it! Take a shot at it! Cigar, tell me what's happening there. Two dead. Neither of them, us. You know what the problem with the world today is? The problem? There's only one? Yeah, it's because there's people out there who think that they can make a difference by playing the hero. What you really gotta remember is to follow orders. All I asked you to do is a simple task. Like you just made a big mess out of it. Severing all ties with you immediately. You want an orange? Ah, uh, no. No orange. No orange. No bad. Motion. What's that guy saying up there? What? Okay. What's that guy saying up there? He's saying another day, uh, another day uh, on the port uh, city of Abrahma. Another day. McGurk said I'd be in and out of here in hours. He told me to do it for America. This is bogus. <laughs> Maybe you are the chosen one. Fate brought you to save. Listen, clown, you may know your way around this sandbox, but you wouldn't last two days without me watching your back, all right? Don't forget that. 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 Bye, bye. Shame, 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 sh